Thanks for hitting play on Average Dave's cards. This video is a little bit of a, a mismatch. This, um, I'm going to open up a blaster of 2018 Series 1 tops that I found on clearance, so not a bad value there. But um, to start off, I'm going to talk a little bit about my first um, submission for grading on my own. Uh, I'm just going to do like a small order, but with the announcement this week that Basketball NBA is returning on July 31st. I kind of really want to take advantage of that and probably the all eyes on a major sport uh, mentality people are going to have. And I really want to take advantage and get some of those cards graded that I think will do well of uh, players in the in established players in the playoffs that maybe can take. Um, I wouldn't say low value cards, but cards in that five to fifteen dollar range, and if they grade well and get tens, really boost their value. Um, so the players I am looking, at, I pick out five cards for my first one. I'm just going to do a small submission uh, through SGC because they're the quickest ones. And I want to get these cards back before July 31st to sell. I mean, this is just straight up flip. I mean, if I'm if I'm going to do this seriously and make a whole bunch of videos on YouTube of my of my hobby, I'm going to have to make it um, self-sustaining. And I think the best way to do that is to pick out some of my best cards, get them graded, and just um, just keep that wheel turning. Um, so the first one is I've opened up quite a bit of Mosaic on the channel, and I am going to grade a just a simple LeBron base. Um, these are going for five to eight dollars a piece. But get a 10 on this and probably becomes like a $25, $30 card after I've invest $10 in grading. Um, so uh, that $10 is without shipping. I think um, shipping is probably like another $3. So like $13 to get it graded. Um, so yeah, I feel like that's just a, a good investment if I get a 10. If I get a 9, I can probably, or 9.5 because I think SGC does 9.5s. Um, I can probably sell it for like 15 and just just break even. So uh, that's my thought there. Um, Jam Masters. And also it's the Lakers. It's LeBron. This is probably the favorite to make the finals in the West. Them are the Clippers. Um, so yeah, just that's just my final. The playoffs are going to really impact the value of these cards. Um, here we got a, one of the more sought-after inserts. Um for Optic, the LeBron James Jam Masters. So, once again, just something that's a $15 card. I'm um, get it graded. Maybe I can get 40 to 50 for it if it hits a 10. Um, really wanted to get a Luka. Uh, the world's going to be exposed to Luka in the playoffs and just see how amazing he is. This is another mosaic insert. Um, this is, I believe, just the, the mosaic insert just named the mosaic. So, uh, once again, hoping to get a 10 on that. Uh, the odds on favorite to win the East. Um, Toronto might have a little something to say about that. But the biggest superstar in the East, for sure, uh, Giannis. So this is a purple My House. The My Houses have a great following for inserts. People love them. And uh, I just really want to get a Giannis graded. And this is the purple parallel. Um, so I think it's a, just a smart thing to do to get one of his graded for the playoffs. And then I also got a purple of the Zion My House. Um, the play-in things will be pretty interesting between um, New Orleans and Memphis. Um, either way, for the NBA, I, it'd be nice if the NBA could get both Memphis or New Orleans in, but I don't think that's going to happen. Um, but either way, it's going to be a win-win. Of course, they would prefer Zion, but getting Jaw in the playoffs it might be a, would be a good thing to do as well. Um, this is another purple insert. This is like, I want to say it's going for like 35 or 40 on eBay comps. But I get this a 10, um, becomes a really, really cool card to have. Um, so that's just my thoughts there. Um, just going small with the my first order, just giving it a shot. Um, hopefully I do well. Um, but if I don't, it'll be a learning experience. And maybe I'll be able to do, know what to do next time. Um, and so I'm going to move on to this Tops Blaster. Just something that I've had for a while sitting around. I feel like opening something. I thought I'd give it a shot here. Um, I've opened up some 2018 Series 1 on the channel before. And we are looking for rookie cards of uh, Devers. Raphael Devers of the Red Sox. 
Walker Bueller of the Dodgers, and Jack Flaherty of the Cardinals. I don't know what 2018 brings. Looks like a ML Players Weekend commemorative patch card. So let's see what we got here. I don't think I've seen these yet. Because I haven't opened a 2018 blaster. I've opened uh, just some fat packs, I think. So, yeah. There we go. Eric Hosmer. I believe he's a Padre now, so. But not too bad. I really like 2020s uh, inserts like that of the like classic rookie cards. But. All right, so let's see what we got here. Schwarber, Pavetta, Greg Allen rookie, Rosario rookie, Barry Larkin, Noah Syndergaard, Alex Verdugo. That's a that's a decent rookie right there. So now of the Red Sox. Um, hopefully baseball can get their um, their stuff together and figure it out when we get a baseball season. Um, or that trade Verdugo for Mookie Betts. If we don't have a season and Betts never plays a game for the Dodgers because he comes a free agent, that's kind of a terrible trade for the Dodgers. <laughs> All right. Uh, Amar Garrett. Klum. Oh, Bellinger. I believe that's Bellinger's second year. Max Fried, rookie. Yachty. Buster Posey. Jock Peterson, Baltimore Orioles, Adrian Beltre, and Ian Kennedy. Holland, Wong, Springer, Sledgers. Big Hurt, Chris Bryant highlights, Aaron Judge, Justin Turner, League Leaders, Smoke, Urias, and a Aaron Judge. I know they're older cards, but uh, it's still kind of cool to find it on clearance. I think they're normally 20 bucks, got for 16 so. Here, Perez. We got a Bader rookie. Garcia. Moncada. Freddie Freeman. Tanaka. Gene Segura. Gio. And some of these rookies, I mean, it's only been two years since the rookie cards. There's still a chance that some of these rookies might just be late bloomers and still pan out. So, Howie Kendrick, Garrell, Mariano, Tanaka, Mats. I believe this is number... Yep, the 2018. So Steven Matz, Chris Davis, Joe Maurer. I don't think this is a short print. It's here, 387. Yeah, 387 seems to be the serial. Nelson Cruz. Morales, Mookie, Eugene Emerald, Trey Turner, looks like we've got a silver coming up, Justin Upton, or a rainbow, my bad, rainbow, the pitcher for the Tigers, Jordan Zimmerman, so, got Brian Dozier, Brad Hand, Christian Vasquez, and Jed Lowry, so we've got Four more packs left, so quite a few packs in that blaster. Uh, make a comment if you guys are thinking about grading any, trying to quickly grade any basketball, what players you think might be uh, some playoff superstars that you think might really um, make the turn in the playoffs. Um, 
I really went just some established, like all time great players of mine. Um, but tell me who you might think be sneaky. Might be a sneaky Clipper player, or that really, uh, really might have a coming out pl party in the playoffs. Yankees team card. Shoop. Gary Sanchez. I would like to hit at least one of the big three rookies in this. Um, like I said before, I've opened up quite a bit. Uh, Raphael Devers has eluded me. So I was Walker Bueller. Um, I think we've hit some Flaherty's though. Reyes, Aaron Judge, league leaders. Hopefully Judge can stay healthy. There's a rookie. Bellinger, Legends in the Making. All right, so here we go. Gahara, rookie. Tillman, Jay Bruce, and AJ Pollock. If I remember right, the Bueller, the Bueller card's horizontal. Yelich, Lucas Sims rookie, Willie Calhoun rookie, Eric Thames, this is a throwback top set 35 years ago, we're opening 08, so that would be 83, McCutcheon, Yasmani Grandel, I thought maybe that would, could have been a Flaherty, but nope, it's Tyler Mall rookie, Chase Anderson, and Buster Posey. Last pack, Rizzo, Kershaw, Brinson, Peter Zerke. What do we got here? We got Robinson Cano, Chris Bryant, Ian Happ, Detroit Tigers, Logan Forsythe. And Suarez. So not the greatest blaster, but still, I wanted to open something. And I uh, want to talk a little bit about NBA and grading and excited to have playoffs coming back. So if you like what you saw, please like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Bye.